Hey guys, and we're with Chuck and Sherry. We are at Myers RV in Madison, Madison Ohio. Ohio. Right? Yes. And we told our Sunset Park family that we had some news for you guys. Um, we're here, we're on site. We're gonna go in here, meet the staff, talk it out, see what we work out for you guys. And so stay tuned. Stay tuned. <laughs> yes. And we're gonna actually Exciting. see a nice little camper here real soon. So. Yeah, so really stay tuned. Yep. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. All right, guys. So we're here with Austin White, Myers RV. We have a special treat for you guys. So Sherry and I were kind of brainstorming, like, what can we do? What can we do for the Sunset Park family or anybody else that's interested in Sunset Park? What better else than they have a new model? This is the 13BD, correct? Yes, sir. Okay. Um, they come in three different floor plans. Mm -hmm. Same pricing on all three, correct? Yep. And they also have, this is their LTD line. They also have a 16 and a 19, I believe, in the LTD. Yep. Okay. Uh, with this particular camper, though, because we know a lot of the Sunset Park people are niche people and like <laughs> tiny and compact, although this is bigger than the 109, this is bigger than the 129, bigger than the 139. I'm going to say it's it's a little bit or real close to the 149-ish. Very close, just a little higher clearance. Just right? a little bit more clearance, uh, a different functionality on the inside, but we're going to do a full tour of this camper, see what it's about. This is sight unseen. We've been here we've been talking to Austin for a little bit here and I haven't set my eyes in this camper yet <laughs> we can't okay? wait we're excited I can't wait to see this camper when I saw it I was like well damn if they had this available when we got a 109 we, we might have not we ever might done have. 109 we might have. but I'm speaking too soon <laughs> yeah. we're gonna go in take a look and see what it has to offer all right all right let's go come on in all right here we go okay sight unseen mm -hmm. and now walking into this space i like it i'm saying let me look oh what's in there this will be a restroom i would hope <laughs> and it's not a wet bath oh, look at this look at and it is not a wet bath so i was thinking it possibly could be a wet bath okay but but yes, it has a shower, right. and I think it's the same size shower, same size shower that we have in our 21 QB, <laughs> if I'm not mistaken. Uh, Murphy bed or just bed? No, bed. This is your physical bed here. Okay, so we got storage underneath this guy. So please have some storage. We got some storage. So we do have your storage. 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 Okay. Oh yeah. We do have That's plenty true. of storage. You can see your fresh water supply there. Looks like your water pump's accessible. Looks like this is also part of your uh, outdoor garage area, correct? Yes, sir. Okay, not bad. Now, when we got our 21 QB, the mattress actually was pretty nice, right? It, they sure. are comfortable. I'm not sure what brand Sunset Park has been using for mattresses, but the 109 mattress was yeah. So we all disaster. know that. We, we all that's know that. That's not their fault. We know <laughs> it is. <laughs> They're just cushions. But the the 21 QB. Mattress yeah, yeah. has been great for us. Mm -hmm. um, this looks nice. We do have some storage on the side. We have some top storage up here, right? Yep. Now, we have cabinets in ours. They don't have enough yes. headspace, yes. I think, mm -hmm. to pull it out. They could probably pull it out, but then you almost like you're in like a dorm or something like that or a bunk bed. You probably tight. wouldn't want that, but this is nice. Nice little stores mm -hmm. initially. I'd probably put a net or something across yeah, the top there. Yeah, some baskets or something. I always recommend that. Baskets yeah. to hold yeah. on. Yeah. TV Basket. backer. Okay, for your 24 inch TV. <laughs> that's all you're going to get there. You're not going to get a bigger TV now. <laughs> but that's all you need. You got your controls over here, Share Bear. That's all pretty standard there. Looks like we got solar. Does this come equipped or not equipped with this, solar? This has a 100 watt solar panel on it. Okay. Nice. Do they all come with solar panels? Is that an option? This this is, uh, for this one specifically, it does come with the solar panel on it. And I'm pretty sure they do come with the 100 watt okay. solar standard. So for most of the BDs, they're going to come with the solar panel. All of the 13 BDs will have 100 watt solar panels. Okay, you heard it. All of them will come. Now, this is one thing. Now, we didn't look into the camper. We saw the camper. Someone in one of our groups, they got the camper. They put it out there first before we could get to them. Um, and we did do a little bit of looking to say, hey, what is this camper? The one thing I noticed, no microwave, no microwave, no stove, right? So that it's a, it's a good point you bring up. Okay. If you open that, that cabinet right there. This one here? Yep. 
microwave hookup? Yes. So you can uh, actually okay. put remove a, the door. Remove the door, mm -hmm. and then you can put it on that one per okay. se. Okay. And then you still gain your cabinet. Okay, guys. So now what he's saying, sure. Let me walk you through it. You're doing a spin a rooney. <laughs> Don't get dizzy. Okay, that book of tea spin a rooney. <laughs> Take this door off here. Now you're gonna to turn to your left, ma'am. You can take this door off here, <laughs> oh, and then we're gonna place it up there. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then you can put your microwave in here. Now is that an option you can get from the factory? So I don't think it's an option from the factory that you can get the uh, the microwave in it, but they all have the outlet there. So in okay. the 19, the 16, they all have the outlet in that cabinet, okay. so that you can you can remove that door. And typically, there's another, you know per se cabinet just waiting for a door gotcha now again with the microwave so i come to uh, myers rv mm -hmm. myers rv and mentor okay so long story short sherry and i this, this place will is never also be. this is your this place is also <laughs> near and dear to yes. Sherry and I heart. We'll be here for 10 because minutes. Because <laughs> this is where we purchased our 109. It is, yes. Okay, in 2020. So that was a Freudian slip. It's what it is. It's we're here in Mentor, okay? But before you interrupted me, Miss, because uh, I had a point. If we yeah. purchase, if someone comes and purchases the camper from you guys, mm -hmm. are you available to supply a microwave if that's an option that they want oh most certainly we've done it a few times already okay so they could do the work for you so if it's something that you can't do if you're not handy tell them hey i want the microwave switch the door put it over there you're good to go love the deep sink this is exactly what we have in our 21 okay the inside stove you only need a few burners you don't i think the ones that they put in most campers it's a little too much because you're not really doing family family cooking indoors right you're not going to use the three burners there's not really enough room right. for it mm -hmm. your handles are hanging over each other mm -hmm. and stuff the two burners perfect i agree i agree got your vent let's see what we got okay now this is a little bit better than what we have right it's a little deeper a little deeper mm -hmm. you got your water connections there got that classic drawer dead space here you got your furnace outlet there right we've got a little space up underneath the sink which is fantastic right what else we got? So now, is there storage underneath here? So this one, I believe, has storage under this one here, and I'll show you. So you get the big storage here. You can okay. put a yeah. basket of you know some sort yeah. in there. Mm -hmm. and yeah. Put your mm. put some sweatshirts or yeah. you know yeah. blanket in there if you need. Yep, and I believe that's pretty typical for uh, Sunset Park. I think some of the other models when we were at the rally that we toured i think they had uh when they had the uh bench style or what what style seating and they call this Di just a dinette, dinette. Yeah. yeah they have the storage underneath there nothing mm -hmm. underneath that one over there so i can go ahead and look for you if oh you wanna... I, I can play let me go ahead and see if, I can, <laughs> see if i can do anything oh you here. got this Chuck. come on <laughs> let me see yeah <laughs> this is your first rodeo oh yep 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 yep, yep. <laughs> for sure we got storage here 100 oh, percent. so that's always nice when you got a tiny camper the biggest thing is and I still consider this a tiny camper. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, the biggest thing is storage. Where do I put this? Where do I put that? Mm -hmm. And if you guys know Sherry and I, <laughs> it's like we just keep accumulating things. Yeah. And we don't know where to put them. Or she stuffs them somewhere and I don't know where to find them. I'm buying it now. Did we, we didn't Off go over any of this, correct? Yeah. Mm -mm. So we got more storage here, which is nice. Okay. So, again, I know people have different versions of what they call couples coach. Okay. But... A single person, single guy, single lady, um, couple, couple with a dog. Even when we were uh, at, come on, help me out. When we were at uh, <laughs> Mohican and, and Chuck <laughs> was there and, and had his friend in the 109. Yes. They had a 109. It was two of them in the 109 with a large dog. Yeah. Okay, so this is more than enough room. Does that turned into um, like was gonna get there <laughs> okay i was gonna Come get on. there I mean, 10 I minutes later <laughs> austin the big question is is it or is it not a, a bed here it sure is so uh, okay just like everyone else you'll go ahead you'll mm. take this uh this yeah. post out yep, you drop this down it. on the frame right yep, there you see it right there oh, yeah, these cushions will slide in oh, yep. right here yep yep drop it down nice. there cushions slide in now yep. i'm gonna recommend to you guys this is for a child or something like that because if you think you're going to be sleeping on here comfortably how do you know i think you should try it out you want me to try it yeah, out yeah let's see we already talked about the one on nine cushions it's the same thing well, i mean that's something that again why it's accessible it's why great. does it have to be a child to sleep there or sherry 
I would dedicate okay. myself <laughs> okay. to sleep on the bed, and Sherry could have this nice yes. space to yourself. You and Kyla could just be cozied up here, watching okay. TV. Looks fantastic. I like the big window on the side, mm -hmm. so I when you're too. eating, okay? Mm -hmm. It is a little tight here, I'm not going to lie. This is your side of the bench here, because I'm going to, I'll, I'll try to, if I can squeeze you see what there. I'm saying? I don't know if I can, it's, it's tight in there, that's a little tight. You gotta take the tight. table off. Well, you don't, you gotta, you know, what if you have the meal prepared? You know, it's a little tight here, but that's okay. You'll make All it right? work. You guys will find a way to make it work. Okay. Can I do it? Okay, nice. Wasn't one of those tricky gadgets. <laughs> nice size fridge. 12 volt. Okay. 12 nice. 12 volt refrigerator. So ours is uh, still do propane in 12 volt. Yep. Which we love. Just Here's, in case. I'm going to take uh, exactly. a video of the bathroom again. I don't know if I went all the way in there. No? Maybe. Go back we'll there. just try it again. <laughs> but yeah. Oh, see? It has a little mirror oh, in there. It does have a mirror. That's what yeah, you wanted, that's huh? That's what I wanted. <laughs> yeah. I have, have to, to talk to, uh, to them about this. Yeah, Bob and Johnny and <laughs> yeah. Merle and those guys and Larry and I Damon think that will say, come Where's in my handy. mirror at? <laughs> yes. <You know? laughs> she's well, been complaining get that. about a mirror in the bathroom <laughs> for a long time. And she, yes. That's the one thing she notices. I'm going to take, right? it, take it with us. That. You got to get dolled up to go camping, <laughs> that's right? right? That's right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, your fuse down here? Yep. Correct? That is correct. Okay. And it's got all the all the the rest of the stuff that you need. Now they do a little something different. Now th is this specific to you guys with the rooftop unit? Uh, this one specifically, yes. So we do have the rooftop unit in this one. However, it does come with the wall mounted um, AC, and that would then become that that uh, space right there. So th what they were explaining to us earlier before we got started was. Again, if you had the wall mounted here, obviously there's no space, but because they've taken it away, this gives you more space for storage in here, okay, mm -hmm. which is fantastic. Um, what else? I mean, there's three of us in this camper right now. Yeah. It's spacious. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's plenty of headroom, plenty yeah. of stretching room. This is nice. It's What's the weight nice. on this guy? This is, uh, call it 2,900 pounds. Okay, so again, still... It's, excuse me, 2,400 pounds. Okay, perfect for a uh, small truck. Uh, probably small SUV yeah. could still get this thing around. Uh, this is a nice size camper. We like this guy. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is one of my favorites. It yeah. is. Let's take a look outside. Come now, on I'm, out. There's there's a negative coming. Uh, I'm, gonna tell you. I'm not gonna mess around. Negative. I'm a little sore, guys. Don't ask why. <laughs> <laughs> my father-in-law put me to work. So the negative portion of this for me, if I were to say, and if you guys watch any of our videos, I'm an outside kitchen guy. Mm -hmm. I am an outside kitchen guy all the way. So a lot of times when, and this is this is a, a specific to you thing, but when I look for something, I'm always like, where's the outside kitchen? How much space does it have? Yeah. And and but this doesn't have it. I understand why because there's not enough room. You make your so own outdoor kitchen. To make up space for not having the outdoor kitchen, you have a lot of room indoors. You do. A lot of mm -hmm. room indoors. And obviously, you're always going to have your propane hookup. So when you get your Blackstone or whatever, yes. your gas one, whatever grills that you got, you're going to set yourself up right here, and you're going to be good to go, and you can still do it cook. Because that's essentially, that's all I use is yes. that Blackstone and exactly. over the fire cooking, right? Yeah. So how important is the outside exactly. kitchen? It's important to me. That's all I can say. But to some people, it's not. The awning. How big an awning do we have here? We got probably, I'd say, a 10-foot awning there. Okay. 10 by maybe six or eight come yeah. out, something like that? Yeah. Okay. So nice, it's good awning. Covers your, your uh, door here. You have your grill, you have your chairs up underneath here. I love the clearance on this thing. It's actually higher than most of the ones that they're putting out, isn't it? Yeah, so they got they got um, a little lift kit on there with your uh, your off-road uh, tires there for all trains. Okay. Um, as you know, some like, wants to kind of get you a little off-road, a little yeah. off-grid type deal. And, with those tires, you can certainly do that. Yeah, definitely, definitely. It looks nice. This one looks like it has uh, stabilizer jacks all around. Four all, of them. All four, yep. Okay, is that standard? It is. We got a spare tire on the back. Myers full size RV, spare. Full size spare. Myers RV Superstore, if you didn't know where we were at. Okay. This is a nice one, 13BD. Right here, here we go. This is where it happens, ladies. <laughs> when the guy's in the truck just waiting, you guys come out here and, and then you, this is your duty time. Okay? Yeah, okay. So that's nice. So we have uh, our down down drains here, right? Mm -hmm. Yep. Low point, low drains. point drains. Got our low point drains. 
we have our gray tank we have our black tank is there flush uh there this is your your gray flush your black flush okay and everything's gonna come out so. okay okay we know that's clean yeah it is <laughs> okay we got we got an outside shower here I can open it up. Get that one open. Got an outside shower. That's pretty typical. Hot and cold water there. Yep. We have our uh, antenna hookup, right? Yep. Yes, sir. Okay. And, you know, we got a hot water tank here. Let's see if we can. Can we get in here? Oh, yeah, okay. we're in. Here's that underneath storage. Okay, so what are the water lines here? Oh, they're just not hooked up, huh? This is another low point drain, or is this, what is this guy here? This uh, is different. This is going to be for your, your winterization. So okay. This is super easy. So you can bypass everything. Mm -hmm. This is nice. Yeah. Very accessible. Super convenient. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice. So. so when you're winterizing and you need to go put the, the, the pink stuff in, the orange stuff, whatever you want to call it, it's right here. Yep. Put it in the tank and, and bring it on in. And uh, nice, easy access to the, uh, what do you call it? The water pump. Mm -hmm. Everything is right there. Fresh water, city water, right? How many gallons we got on the fresh water? On your fresh water, I think you're in the 30s, I want to say. I will double check that Okay, that, Okay, that's important. Mm -hmm. um, and the gray and black, do we know? I want to say mid-20s. Mid okay. So I will confirm that, though. Okay. Okay. Up at the tongue, 20-pound tank. We get a battery. What, what is it, interstate battery? Interstate battery, yep. Green okay. Grade. And you're cranking, okay? You can probably get an upgrade here. So what's nice is if you have the stabilizer jacks, you can always keep your, um, to drill, to your drill and then you can also drill this too so that you don't have to crank it oh, all. Oh, nice. Okay. Yep. Good, good. I, so with one we purchased, mm -hmm. they've changed this. The one we per we had to get a new one where it I can use the drill and I can go all the way around and do that. They already did that for you. Perfect, man. All in all, this is a nice unit. 2024 Sunlight 13 BD. I okay. love it. And now the magic happens. We're gonna go in here, talk with Jim. Yep. Austin, our, our newfound buddy. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Ohio State BFFs. Buckeye fan all Forever. the way. Forever. Okay. Yeah. Ohio State, you know, you guys know how we do. We don't hold that against us. Uh, you, guys, yeah. you guys up north. Yeah. But still, we're gonna go in here, try to work out with Jim, see what we can do, see what kind of pricing we can get specifically for our viewers, for specifically for our Facebook groups. And if you guys see this, if you guys hear this, call them. We'll have air all the information at the end of this and you're gonna get that price, okay? All, all right. for you guys. Thank you, man. Thank, Thank you guys Thank so you. much. Yes, Pleasure sir. meeting you guys. All right. all right guys, we're back. Went inside, got paperwork, talked with Jim, talked with crew, awesome people in there. Very family oriented. Very, very, very. Yes. Appreciate all that they offer, all that they've done for us. Yes. Special pricing on the 13BD, okay, 14980 and that's going to run from March 15th through April 15th, okay? So if you guys see this post, if you see this video, you guys call Myers RV, Madison, Ohio. Let them know you saw our video. Let them know you're with Chuck and Sherry, and you're going to get that special pricing on that unit there. On top of that, though... We would, if you do get it from the special pricing, we are going to come out and we want to meet you. We want to celebrate with you. Swag bag. Swag, all the good okay. stuff, all right? Now, don't, now, you all can't flood them because, you know, we only got <laughs> enough, a few shirts to give out. But <laughs> yeah. uh, So we're going to go back to this. Dry weight, and this is going to be on the 13BD, 13BH, and the 13MJ. Dry weight, 2380. Hitch weights, 240 pounds. Carrying capacity is 1320. The length, overall length is 16.2. Overall height is 19.9. Interior height is 16.6. Exterior width, 7.6. Water capacity, 26 gallons. Gray water, 28 gallons. Black, 33. I feel like There's, we're at an auction. Yeah, <laughs> I know. That's all the dimensions on the 13 model. Yes. The LTD, okay, brand new from Sun, Sunset Park, Sunlight. Okay, go out, call these guys, flood the lines. Yeah. Get you. Have any questions, comment. <laughs> All right. Till next time. Safe travels.